my ship is going to sell and I'm going to get some USDT in my USDT wallet. So go back to wallet and see my spot wallet. I have zero dollar. Now I have it has changed. It just changed before our eyes, $15. Hello and welcome to this Binance tutorial. So in today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to convert your cryptocurrency into stablecoin. So I'm going to be showing you in my wallet here some of the cryptocurrency I have and how I'm going to be changing that cryptocurrency from cryptocurrency into stablecoin. As you can see on my ship here, the second currency I have in my wallet is ship and I have $66 there and I'm going to be changing this ship to USDT. On my USDT wallet, I have $0.5 there. Now what is the importance of changing your cryptocurrency into a stablecoin? First, what is a cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency are all these, um, let me show you examples of cryptocurrency. Cryptocurrency are all these BNB, cryptocurrencies are all these BNB, Bitcoin, Ethereum, SHIB, Inu and the others. Those currencies are very volatile. The prices can increase at any time and the prices can go down at any time. So if you have cryptocurrency, you are at the risk of losing your money or you can also make a lot of money. So if you have a cryptocurrency in your wallet, because the price are constantly changing, the money you have in that cryptocurrency is con constantly changing. If the price is going up, it's also going up. If it's going down, your money is going down. But for stablecoin, stablecoin are all these BUSD, USDT, USDC. Those things are stablecoins. Those stablecoins, the prices are always fixed. The prices are not changing. The same amount you have today is the same amount you have tomorrow. Is the same amount you have next year. So that's why they are called stablecoin and cryptocurrency are called volatile because they are always changing. So for example, if you see the SHIB versus USDT, let's see the market trend of this currency. So this is the market trend of SHIB. You know, you can see how the price has been going up and going down, going up and going down. Let me put it on 15 minute scale. So you can see how the prices has been changing. For ship, you know, but if I show you a more stable a stable coin, let me show you an example of a stable coin. This is BUSD versus USDT. They are both stable coin. You will see the market trend. So the market trend has just been fixed. As you can see, the graph is very different. The market trend has just been fixed. And if you can see the amount there is one dollar. So it's just changing between one dollar, one point zero zero zero. See the market is fixed. Let me show you another example of stablecoin usdc versus usdt so you can see these two see how the market price is just fixed at one dollar the price is not changing it's just there at one dollar so this is a stable coin but if i show you this is the price this is the trend for bitcoin you see how the price is changing just take note of that price going up and going down put it at one hour see how the price is changing so what is another reason why i will want to change my ship you know to usdt another reason is if i want to trade it and turn it to cash on the p2p platform so on the p2p platform here most people are selling or buying usdt so you can trade other currencies but most people are trading selling or buying usdt so if i want to sell my ship you know for cash i have to change it to usdt then come to the p2p platform and change it for cash for money that will be sent to directly to my account number my normal cash account number my fiat account number so let's just go ahead and let me show you the tutorial how i'm going to change some of my ship you know from ship in to stablecoin usdt so to do this i'll just come to the spot trade under trade click on trade and click on spot it's already clicked on spot and i'm going to choose okay so i'm going to come here and search for ship it's already selected ship but i want to show you the steps that you can use so i'm just come i'll come there and search for ship so i can see ship usdt already ship usd so I, I want to change from ship to usdt so i'll click ship usdt and yeah that's it there so as you can see what we have here is buy buy is when i want to buy ship but i don't want to buy ship i want to sell ship for usdt so i'm going to click on sell so it has changed to the sale market so now i'm going to be selling some of my ship for usdt and as you can see on that where it's saying avbl that is available 
you can see the available ship that i have i mistakenly clicked something there so we can see the available ship that i have i have 2862728.77 so what is the total of this so um okay the total is 66 dollars but i don't want to sell all my ships so for the sake of this tutorial i'm just going to sell a little of my ship so first of all under the limit trade in spot trading sell i'll first come and set my market price so we can see by the right we can see the market price changing and that is how we are going to determine the price we are going to set so i'm going to set a price so that when ship gets to that price my ship is going to sell so the, currently the price is 2336 okay it's now it's 233 okay 2336 when it's showing red is going down but when it's showing green that means the price is going up so i'm going to set it for a higher price so for the sake of this tutorial because i just want to sell quickly i'll put it in a price that it's going to enter immediately so i'll just put six there since the market is at 2335 then i'll put the amount of um usdt i want to sell so let me sell 15 dollars so okay i want to sell 15 dollars the price has gone up to 2336 so let me change it to 2337 it has gone up to 2337 let me put it to 23389 okay i'll put it at eight now it's at seven so when i open this trade okay let me wait for it to go down so i can sell at 2338 so i have set the price for 2337 so that i can sell very quickly now the price is 2336 and i want to sell 15 dollars out of my 66 dollar usdt okay the price has gone up to okay it has gone down now so i'll fix it come on okay so i'll fix the price for 2337 so when it goes higher than 2337 my ship is going to sell and i'm going to get some usdt in my usdt wallet so go back to wallet and see my spot wallet i have zero dollar now i have it has changed it just changed before our eyes fifteen dollars that means my market has entered that means my trade has entered so i'll go back to trade to check that so okay as you can see the trade has disappeared so i've been able to sell fifteen dollars out of my ship cryptocurrency to stablecoin usdt so i have $51 in my ship Inu now and I have $15 in my USDT so that is how to convert cryptocurrency into stablecoin now you can now use that cryptocurrency that you have to trade for other um for other coin so now since I have USDT I can come here and pick BTC USDT so now I can now trade I have I can now go to buy so because i now have some cryptocurrency as you can see available 15 dollars usdt so because i now have some usdt i can now trade with bitcoin so the current price of bitcoin is this 38402 dollars i can come and put here that i want to buy bitcoin when it drops to 35000 35000 dollars and I'll just put my maximum $15 and I'm going to click on buy. So when Bitcoin gets to $35,000, I'm going to buy some Bitcoin. So that is another reason why you want to change your cryptocurrency to stablecoin. When it's in stablecoin, you can use you can use it to trade any peer. You can use it to trade any cryptocurrency peer. So if we come under USDT, for example, you see these are all the options of things we can trade with usdt so when you convert your cryptocurrency to stablecoin like usdt you can use it to trade all these things this is another stablecoin busd you can use it to trade a lot of cryptocurrency peers so like i have set for this bitcoin now so when bitcoin drops that's five dollars i'm going to sell so thank you for watching this tutorial i hope you understood it so in the next tutorial i'm going to be trading practically in the p2p platform so the usdt that i just bought i'm going to be selling it off on the p2p platform to get some cash into my bank account i'm going to show you how to sell your usdt on the cryptocurrency on the binance cryptocurrency p2p platform to convert 
my USDT to cash. So money is going to be sent direct to my fiat bank account that I use normally from Binance P2P platform. So subscribe to this channel if you have not for more of this cryptocurrency tutorial like this. See you in the next tutorial. Cheers.